GoPro footage of Ukrainian troops shooting Russian military with machine guns, shooting from a machine gun at close range, shooting from all sides and incredible adrenaline. This epic shot from a GoPro camera is of the Ukrainian attack on one of the landings in the Kharkiv region. Russian troops covered the approaches with 120mm mortars, but the fighters dived into the dense green forest, started the battle and did not stop, even when wounded. Soldiers of the 2nd Company of the 2nd Mechanized Battalion of the 3rd Assault Division show how to move confidently when you're on the ground. Combat medics at ground zero, Russian troops in the Kharkiv region hid right in the trenches, where soldiers of the 3rd Assault Division helped the wounded. Therefore, as quickly as possible, the medics came out and evacuated their members under Russian fire, and so on from one ditch to another, from soldier to soldier, who was swabbed, bandaged, and saved. The hard work of the 3rd Company of the 2nd Mechbat, from the perspective of a Ukrainian combat medic. Ukrainian border guards leave Ukrainian territory every day. In particular, the Ukrainian military recently defeated Russian infantry in the Volshonsky direction. This was reported by RBC Ukraine with reference to the State Border Guard Service. According to the State Border Guard Service, accurate mortar fire from the Border Guard Brigade Gart, caused damage to the Russian infantry in shelters and on the way. The video shows how the Ukrainian military launched a precise attack on Russian troops. Today we report how many Russian vehicles in general were destroyed by the Ukrainian military during the full-scale invasion. Over the past week, the Ukrainian army destroyed nearly 8,000 Russian drones. Over the past 24 hours from July 27 to 28, Russia lost 1,180 troops and 30 unmanned aerial vehicles in the war in Ukraine. The total combat losses of the enemy from February 24, 22 to July 28, 24 were, personnel, about 574,690 plus 1180 people liquidated. Tanks 8,344 plus 13 units. Armored fighting vehicles 16,095 plus 21 units. Artillery systems 15,936 plus 51 units. MLRS 1127 plus 2 units. Air defense systems 906 plus 1 units. Airplanes 363 units. Helicopters 326 units. UAVs of operational tactical level 12,766 plus 30 units. Cruise missiles 2,405 plus 2 units. Ships boats 28 units. Submarine 1 unit, automotive equipment and tank trucks 21,572 plus 72 units. Special equipment 2,671 units. The Russians are actively advancing in the Pokrovsky direction in the Donets region. Over the last 24 hours, there was also turbulence on the southern front, but the Russians were unsuccessful. In total, 96 military clashes were recorded on the front lines over the past 24 hours. Also last night, aggressors attacked southern and central regions of Ukraine with shard attack drones, 